when I talk about music theory and, and why I was mentioning music theory, well, one of the reasons, one of the many reasons, was that when I'm making a song, I don't think about music theory when I'm making a song. I don't think, oh, I'm going to put, do a major third and I'm going to uh, use a Mixolydian scale and I'm going to... And I don't think of it that way. It's just that's just not my approach. And there are there are music theory people who will try to tell someone how they created a song. And it's just like, no, you you don't know how I created the song. Well, it's a base of this and this and has this and this, therefore it's this. Well, yeah, you can break apart the song that way if you wish, but that's not how I came up with it wasn't even thinking of that sort of thing when I came up with it. You know, and that's the kind of thing I'm trying to, to convey here. Um, sociology can, can declare that all of these things are attached to white supremacy. It doesn't mean that's the intention. It only means that's a lens in which you can view this through. So when you view the, the world through the lens of racism, yeah, you're, you're going to see that everywhere. And the same can apply to any... If you, if you view the world through a particular lens, yeah, you're going to see things that way. Just like if you're going out looking for problems, you're probably going to find them. I, I'm sure that we can see misogyny in, you know, Mario Brothers and Miss Pac-Man. Right? I, 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 I'm sure you, we can see misogyny in those things if you really, really want to break it apart. But if you're trying to view the world through uh, a, the, the lens of, uh, okay, how misogynistic is this? Yeah, you're going to find a lot of stuff. I mean, you're going to find a lot of things that weren't intended to be that way, you know. Now, you can say that it's important for us to, to look at the patterns because, look, this is what this can equal. Fine, I guess. But what good does it do if there are no answers? I mean, other than and then telling people not to, to not to make games that are like this. So when it comes to the, this whole sociology thing with uh, uh, white supremacy, it's like the the only answers that are out there that would actually that would actually change anything would be kind of going against capitalism. It would be the whole equality of outcome model. That's the only thing that I've been seeing. And we're apparently not supposed to have any even uncomfortability with that at all because, well, you know, if you really looked at black history in the United States, uh, you know, a form of reparations, right? I can see your argument, but I also see that all it's going to cause is resentment if you actually push this thing forth.